Search and destroy. <laughs> Defend the objective. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's your dude, it's your guy, it's your man, your bro. My name is Ernest Lee, and this is a Groundward Domination game on a WMD. And that noise Jimmy was making is the circus clown noise thing I make when I get funny clips. And for some reason, he thought he could take that from me. No, 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 no. That's mine. Um, I'm, not, I'm not really sure what that noise was. Um, this is a FAL, FN, FAL, fucking FAL gameplay. And uh, this is recorded within the past week when I was doing the nature challenge. Nader. 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 I don't. That's so weird. It just reminds me of something. But anyway, besides the point. Uh, yeah, so this video that's coming up on the screen right now is me playing Claw style. And I looped this video, I think, once or twice. Um, claw is how I hold the controller. And as you can see, I use the pointer finger to press the, uh, the, the, I guess buttons, the color buttons in this, and then my right thumb, my beautiful, look at my beautiful hands, oh my god, you're so sexy, oh my god, look at you, um, to, uh, I use my right thumb to use a joystick, and then my uh, middle finger to press the trigger, and I've experienced over time, this is years, in years of playing, and gaming, and being a nerd dork, from Halo 1 to Halo 2, um, that I shoot faster that way, I did it originally with Halo 1 and using the pistol, and I never ever stopped doing it and I will say um, my little take home and I'll probably use tutorial for this one day or show you exactly how I play with this um, but my little take home advice don't do this if your hand can't handle it and I'm not saying this in a cocky way in any way like that but I'm saying this will destroy your hand this is not good for your hand physically if there's anybody out there who studied anatomy or how the body works or how the bone works what it does is it creates um, unnecessary pressure on your thumb and on your pointer finger and what happens over time and I uh, actually a year and a half okay what happened was two years ago actually I was in college and I didn't go to the doctor too much because I'm a fucking I'm a freak of nature I'm an ape I'm an aborigine um, <laughs> Not to offend you, Aborigines. Sorry for Steve yelling. He obviously did something cool. Um, but anyway, two years ago, I was in college. I didn't go to the doctor too often. And for guys, you know, you don't have to go to the doctor too often unless you have like a urinary tract infection or something nasty like that. But um, that's never mind. Um, but anyway, I would get this pain in my hand. I used to play a lot of Xbox, like Gears. Um, claw style doesn't work so well for Gears. Um, from my experience, or I just suck at gear, so that's my excuse. Um, and so I would be playing a lot of games, as always, and I got like this horrible, horrible hand cramping. Not from masturbating, you pervs, but from playing games, and I had no idea why. My hand would be sore, uh, primarily in my thumb, the bottom of my thumb, and where your thumb connects to your wrist, like that area. It'd be sore all the time, and I, you know, I lift weights, or I go to the gym. <laughs> yeah, I lift weights, yeah, bros. Um, I go to the gym and I, you know, I, if my hand hurts, I'm going to notice, you know, and for other reasons, of course. Um, but for the most part, like, I never really dealt with it. Look at my flamethrower feed. Um, I didn't really care, and I was in college, I was just kind of like, whatever, fucking, this is dumb. Um, I'm young and I'm, I'm restless or reckless. Young and the reckless, restless, rest, whatever. But basically, over time, I had this fluid build up, and I have, um, Tenosynovitis, and that is the inflammation of your synovial fluid, or uh, sorry, in inflammation of your synovial tissue, and that's when fluid builds up in the tissue, and basically it's not good. It's inflammation. There is no true, uh, pure treatment for it. Think of it like arthritis, or uh, you know something along those lines. It the only way to actually treat it, treat it is to basically exercise it. 
don't use it as much. Use anti-inflammatories. Um, ice it. Do a bunch of things, basically. Things that, that aren't necessarily medicine, medicine, but rather um, change of habits. So let's say, if you're much, much like if you're an overeater, fat-ass pig, you don't need medicine. You just need to change your habits. And that's basically what I have um, come to realize and I went to the doctor a year and a half ago so I lived with this for like nine or nine or ten months and then I went to the doctor a year and a half ago and she said I just need to go to the physical therapist and you know I've been to school before or I was in school um, at the time and I was just like uh so I YouTubed and Googled a bunch of exercises I could do but in the end I just ended up not doing it <laughs> I just didn't care and I still don't care as much as much as I should and it's one of those dumb dumb decisions like I have a splint I have uh, you know I should be taking ibuprofen or whatever whatever it is I'm supposed to be taking uh, and ice it every single day and all that good stuff but I just you know I haven't come around to it and honestly it only really happens when I play uh, too much or too often it's like lately and the point of me telling you guys this um, story about how I'm accident prone is a uh, or injury prone is when I use the FAL for the, the Nader challenge, <coughs> excuse me, it was probably the worst experience of my life. And the, the day that I had this recorded, I think it was one week ago, I was talking to Steve and I was like, holy shit, I'm destroying my hand. And it it's because of the right, uh, my right middle finger has to keep pressing uh, the trigger button to shoot the FAL. And I was doing that basically all day and some, like two days worth of the FAL. And it really has taken a toll on my hand and I've uh <clears throat> since then I've uh <coughs> excuse me since then I've uh, still had my hand sore and it has not been this sore since Black Ops come came out when I was playing this game like or when I was working playing this game for eight hours and sleeping for like no hours. Um but yeah I definitely don't suggest people to do claw style if it's uncomfortable for you, if it's difficult for you when you first start doing it. You probably don't want to do it at all. I mean, it's it's one of those things. Um, it's just I don't know. It, it there's lots of benefits of doing it, but at the same time, it is not a natural feeling. It is not a natural grip that anybody should be doing or holding or experiencing, honestly. And and you know, as young people, as us young people, as us young peeps, there's a lot of things that you know our parents say, and we don't listen to, but. And a lot of them have to regard health. And I will say, you know, as part of a, as part of this profession that I'm in, which is dietetics and part of the healthcare uh, field, um, that a lot of problems. Ha oh, <clears throat> I feel like I have a monster amount of phlegm in my throat. Uh, a lot of the problems that happen, I got shit on, that happen are due to the fact that people neglect to take care of themselves over time. It's never immediate. It's never one thing that happens right away. It's always something that happens over time. So anyway, this this game is actually super laggy. I probably should have said that at the beginning. Um, it was ridiculously laggy. I'm using Blackbird and Mortar Team because I like using Mortar Team because it's fun. As I failed this three-piece, that would have been an epic defense clip for the challenge, but whatever. Um, but yeah, with the challenge, I had a lot of basically two pieces like that that are failed for the last kill or three pieces that are uh, broken up in the kill feed and that happens a lot when you play ground war you know it's just not um it's just not likely let <laughs> me just <laughs> flip through that guy um, it's just not gonna happen you're not going to get those great clips in ground war clean kill feeds unless you're using high lethal kill streaks or something like that but anyway my name is Ernest Lee I capped one flag I don't give a shit in this because we're just pub stopping Katie whoring Doing things that I don't normally do. But anyway, my name is Ernest Lee. Like I just said, connection interrupted. Blink, I'm blinking, blinking. Anyway, thanks for watching. And of course, leave a comment, rating, suggestion. And oh, yeah, I love you all. Bye.